Welcome to a video from the Lifestyle.com. New Windows 10 build to look at. This is 18282 for Windows Insides on the fast ring and using skip ahead. And there's a nice new feature in this called Windows Light Theme. So currently in the dark theme, and um, you see the taskbar here. This is the color it would be if I was in the old light theme. So let's have a look at what's changed. So I've chosen light there and now look I've got this much lighter theme look at the bottom here this is uh, really different it's much lighter before it was that dark color even if you had the light theme and now we've got light and there's a new back lock screen to go with this as well so, or a new background color so let's change that so there's the new light color let's have this automatic as well and we could even have custom so the apps can have light or dark mode so let's um, so there's a light mode and let's put the app in dark mode and we have windows in light mode so you can see we we've got this combination of of mode now so windows is in the light mode the apps are in dark mode or we can go light and light and there's this nice light effect there you go so this is the new light theme i actually really like that and uh, then we've got this new light background to go with it okay what other changes are there there's a couple other things the uh, snipping tool or snip and sketch the new version of that has got an option as well as the timing option there is um, a windowed option so let's just do a new one and see I haven't got the windowed option enabled because only doing it on 50% of Windows Insiders so but anyway that's one of the new features you may have that you may not right printing has changed they've um, now support the new light theme so let's try and print something so here's the new print dialog box um, if you've got a long name it'll also make sure it fits on there and it's got this new light theme and it's got this more modern modern look to it Right, another thing that's changed is over on Windows Update. So there's the option to pause updates. You didn't currently, uh, you had to sort of dig around in the settings for that, and uh, now you don't. Uh, automatically adjust active hours based on usage. So this will calculate when I use it. It says my current active hours is 9 p.m. to 10 p.m., which probably because I use this device a lot in the evenings, and not for my day job, and it's going to recalculate that. So it optimizes that for the best, the best time. There's some changes to Narrator um, and the other updates, things like File Explorer, they've stopped that uh, freezing, they've fixed an issue with certain uh, x86 games having blurry, uh, apps and games having blurry text when rendering, uh, so fix some launching issues, uh, some Win32 default app issues, some Narrator mode issues, they've fixed issues with um, some uh, machines are getting a green screen crash when it's coming out of hibernation you get a PCD watchdog timeout they, f they fix that and uh, they've fixed the issue with it going through Windows update I don't know if you've seen this when you've been trying it but uh, it would sort of cycle through getting things ready downloading installing have an error message and then do it again they fix that and they've updated start menu and task list jump list to now have a touch of fluent design So let's look at the. Okay, there you go. So there's the jump list with the extra fluid design. There are some known issues. PDFs may not display correctly. There's um, a crash if you're using a pin. Uh, after changing a pin, uh, there's some dynamic lock may miss may um, is missing from signing settings. They're working a fix on that and uh, some crashes when viewing storage so those are the main changes um, with this build here's the new light theme i do uh, i do like that um, 
I used to prefer the light theme to the dark theme, then I got sort of convinced that the dark theme is nice and I got used to that. Um, now I'm going back on the light theme, there it is with the image, looking good. So thanks for watching this video, more on the digitallifestyle.com, our YouTube channel and on my Twitter at iStixon.